Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, hi, I'm Madeline and I'm so happy that you are here today. Thank you for clicking on my video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how I did this makeup look with my Billion Dollar Beauty box. Billion Dollar Beauty sent this to me to do an Instagram Reel makeup tutorial with. If you want to watch that, my Instagram is always in the description. If you don't follow me, you totally should. If you want to check that out, that is on Instagram. But basically, Billion Dollar Beauty sent me a kit to make my own little customizable palette. So I have four eyeshadows, two eyebrow products, a pomade, and a powder, a blush highlighter, and then a lip balm. The lid of it is a mirror, and I just think that that is so handy, especially for travel. They sent me all these shades to choose from. You can go online and pick out what you would want to put in your little box. I just picked some colors that I would use every day. I kept a super natural palette but they have so so many things to choose from in here. They have a wide range of shades for your brows, tons of lip balm colors, tons of eyeshadow colors. It is really such a neat and unique product. They didn't ask me to do a YouTube video. I just wanted to give them a shout out on here as well and show you guys a more in-depth tutorial than I did on my Instagram just because I love this palette so much and I just want to tell more people about it because I think it is really such an incredible product. Without further ado, let's jump on into the video. Okay, so, so far I have on my foundation, concealer, powder, and bronzer. I just used my everyday ones that I use in literally every makeup video. I use my, I'll pull it out, Fenty Matte Foundation, Tarte Shape Tape, the Airspun Powder, and then my Benefit. Hula bronzer, that's all I've used so far, and we are going to go ahead and dive on into this little box and continue my makeup from there. I'm going to use these two brow products first. One is a powder and then one is a pomade. I've never used um, powder brow products until I had this palette, so I was super excited to play with it. I'm going to use this e.l.f. eyebrow spoolie thing and then the morphe m165 eyebrow brush like i do every time i do my brows i really need my brows done honestly they are looking rough but i'm first gonna go in with the pomade and kind of outline my brow and create the shape i want and then go in with the powder and fill them in are now filled in. Brows are not my strong suit, as you can probably tell right now. Um, I wish I was better at brows, but honestly, everyone does them so different nowadays that it honestly doesn't even matter how I do mine because everyone does them different. I am going to do my eyeshadow. I picked these four eyeshadow colors to go in my little box. I just thought that this was a nice little quad and that this would be super easy to make natural looks with. And I primarily wear super natural makeup anyways. For brushes for eyeshadow, I'm just going to be using Morphe Jaclyn Hill brushes like I always do. And we are going to start with the lightest shade and kind of just put that everywhere. I'm going to build it up mostly in my crease, but it is going to go all over my lid. Now we are going to take our nice little orangey shade. I absolutely love using orange eyeshadows. I'm going to put this all in my crease by the way. But I really love orange eyeshadow because I feel like it just looks so nice with blue eyes. And I do technically have blue eyes but um, they're pretty gray. They're not super vibrant and I feel like the color of my eyeshadow can sometimes bring them out so that's why I like to use these kinds of colors. It still stays pretty natural but helps my eye pop. Now we are going to use this brown shade and keep that. We're going to keep that in our outer crease and kind of blend it and make a triangle shape just on the outer half of my lid. More like outer third but y'all know what I mean. We're going to blend it with 
that orange shade that we just used. Next, I sprayed my brush with some MAC Fix Plus and we're gonna use this glitter shade and just put that on the inner half of my lid. And then I'm just gonna blend that in the center real quick. We are going to take this orange shade and pop that under my waterline. We are going to use the highlight shade I have in my palette and put that in my inner corner and then pop that up on my brow bone. So that is the eyeshadow. I'm going to go ahead and finish my eyes with some eyeliner, mascara, and I might put some lashes on. I don't know yet. And then I will come back to finish the rest of this look. All right, I am back. I just put on some eyeliner. I used the Maybelline Master Precise All Day Liquid Liner and the Wonder Beauty Mile High Club Mascara. And then I just popped on some Ardell Demi Wispies. I don't really like the way they're laying, but whatever I don't feel like taking them off and struggling to get them to lay nice so this is just how it's gonna be what I think is kind of funny about this palette if there was anything to say that I don't like about it, it would be that it doesn't come with a bronzer I think that's super weird so I already have bronzer on my face and I'm just gonna use Morphe Jaclyn Hill brushes and use the blush shade I picked in here I super super love the blush I'm not sure if it's Picking up as vibrant on camera as it is in real life, but it is such a stunning blush and I normally want to go for a super um, natural blush, but I really love this one. And then we are going to use the highlight shade. I'm going to highlight my cheekbones, my nose, a little, little bit on the forehead. It comes with a lip balm and I don't have a lip brush. So we're going to see if my finger can do the trick. Oh, that actually kind of worked. I think since I put such a neutral little lip shade in there, and that it worked so well, I don't know if it would work with one of the more vibrant lip shades that you can pick out to put in here. I'm gonna set my face real quick and then I will show you guys the finished look. So this is the finished look. I am absolutely obsessed with this box. I think that it is just so convenient for travel and the colors are absolutely stunning. It works so well. I am in love with this. Billion Dollar Beauty did not ask me to do a YouTube video or anything. They just sent me this for an Instagram collaboration, but in case they see this, thank you so much Billion Dollar Beauty for sending me this box and all of the shades you sent me. Holy cow, this will be so helpful when I do other people's makeup for prom and then I have a wedding coming up to do makeup for and I just think that this will come in handy a lot for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up so that I know. Leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you hit the notification bell so that you don't miss an upload from me.